Now it's time for the turkey. I cook it with all the giblets, the penises and the jinies. And now a lot of people like to baste their turkeys, but I use this. I lick like that and get into the little hiney hiney hole. <laughs> That's nice and good. I don't know what the hell that is, but I lick it anyway. Oh. Up and down. Oh. And then I like to dip that right on there. Hey everyone, welcome to the Hump Day Show. I'm Elias. Shit, we're starting. It's Los, Denise. <laughs> Hi! On this very special Thanksgiving-y. thanksgiving, -y. thanksgiving -y. We're so thankful episode. First of all, we want to thank you guys for listening and watching. Yes. Like, the continued support has been awesome. Uh, we've, we've moved, like, from our shitty production <laughs> downstairs to a less to, shitty production. To a less shitty production <laughs> upstairs. Uh, yeah. We're moving up we in the world. from the bottom. Now we're here. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> so funny. And, no. uh, yeah. <laughs> you're hilarious. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we're on Spotify. So hey. our podcast, our main podcast is going to be on Spotify. Uh, the Hump Day Show is kind of not because it's more visuals sometime. So, but anyways, thank you so much. I'm Elias. This is Los. And this is Em. Um, today's uh, hump day show. Fuck, I can't Today's keep, podcast. I can't keep my shit together right now. <laughs> what are we talking about again? What we're thankful um, for. What we're yes, thankful for. Yes. It's our hump day show. It's our hump day show. What are and we thankful for? What we hate. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a little. Yeah. It's, you it's, can't have the good without the bad. Yeah, it's good to be thankful, but you know, we love to hate. You know? Uh, we love to hate. Uh, and we're kind of going over we what we love and what we hated you this, Jake this year. Do you have like. Uh, Anything that he's thankful for. Bebop. Bebop. That's it. And then his hateful. Yeah, Bebop. That's it. This whole world. He wouldn't have like a thing. His hateful list would be like. Yeah, his hate list would probably, yeah. He would be probably have three on the hate list, one on the thankful list. So this would be reversed for us. So let's just jump into it. Let's just jump into it. We're going to do it kind of like three to one, and then we're going to talk about our hateful shit. But um, let's go and start with them. What do you third favorite is thankful for? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Why do you ask what? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, mine's not really in ladies any first particular order, but oh, I'm thankful for memes. For memes, yeah, memes. because they make me laugh. Well, there have been some good memes this year, but no, memes, but memes are funny. <laughs> No, you don't think. We talking are about fun. memes, bro? I'm thankful for memes, memes because whenever I'm sad, my friends send me memes. Okay. And I'm okay. thankful. Well, okay. I guess. So I'm that's what we know is whenever you're sad, yeah. send you a damn meme. Yeah, and it has to be a funny one. It can't be like something. Yeah, not just something. But I meme. love memes like that. That whole nickel back. <laughs> <laughs> I'll send it to you so you can post it. <laughs> memes are funny. Memes. Okay. That's memes. yeah. Memes. <laughs> memes. Memes. memes? Yeah. Memes? Who yeah. says that? I love memes. I don't know. I know somebody I've heard that people says saying memes, memes though. It's yeah. weird. But um yeah, I guess. I know memes. You, what do you mean you guess? Sure. Why not? Memes. Mine's better than your list. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So the the third most <laughs> thankful thing I am thankful for in the Thanksgiving Thanksgiving season season of killings. Sizzing. Um I'm so thankful for Avengers Infinity War. It is <laughs> the most epic combination of superheroes and <laughs> and and, yeah, really and, and people coming together and it worked so well it, it was such a great movie of, of, of this uh, of entourage of having everybody together and it's just oh man I'm just so thankful for it thank you Stan Lee for creating those characters again yes yeah, Stan Excelsior. Lee Mr. Stan Lee guy guy <laughs> well actually I heard you were pretty F. shitty that could be a like a <laughs> like a a combo. You're thankful for the movie. Yeah, you're thankful for Stan Lee. Yeah, yeah. Okay. it's two in one. Cause two in one. no, but no, but in all seriousness, in seriousness. Uh, yeah, I'm thankful for that movie. It's so much fun. I love watching it, rewatching it. Uh, it's not my favorite movie, but any any chance. But it's it's something for this year. I'm thankful for. Um. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Um, <laughs> this year, I'm thankful for um, Travis Scott. Oh. This guy has come out of, of hiding, of the of Straight the up. slums, of the ghetto, 
The slums. Yes. To, what slums? To bring us what ghetto? the best album of the year. From where? The best oh, album of the year. God. All the questions. Um, <laughs> to bring us the best album of the year, the soundtrack of the year. Uh, when you hear the songs that came out on this album, you're going to remember 2018. Um, and Not only or no, Sicka Mode. For bringing back... Oh. For bringing Astroworld, for bringing Astroworld <laughs> back to Houston, yeah, 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 yeah. single-handedly bringing back Astroworld, uh, I mean, something that no one else could have I mean, done. Businessmen have tried for years to I mean, find out what to do with the Astrodome, to find out what to do. No, it was Travis Scott um, for repping the H, Yeet. for doing all he does for that town of Houston. Okay. Um, you, you know, are. for supporting our teams. Okay. You know, he's been there for Houston. Um, <laughs> so I, I, I'm just thankful for Travis Scott. I think he's a outstanding Houstonian. Uh, I'm proud to to be, you know, in the, considered in the same atmosphere as Travis Scott. Um, hey, if you ever want to come on the show, if you ever want to come on the show, please, Travis, holler at me, Public Enemy 59. It's late. Um, we'll be more than happy to have you on the show, but... Yeah, thank you, man. I'm thankful for you, your music, uh, for repping the great H sound. Uh, you're a great ambassador of the uh, of Houston, and uh, just keep it up. Work hard. Work hard, sir. Uh, okay, let's go on to our number two most thankful thing. I feel like this episode is so somber. So like, yeah. It's chill. It's chill. It's chill. <laughs> It'll probably get funny once we get to our hateful thing. Yeah, though. we're gonna fuck shit over. <laughs> but right now, let's just keep it nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're being nice people right Come on, now. Guys, watch your language. Go ahead. Uh, I'm, <laughs> okay, this is gonna be a weird one, but I'm thankful for uh, one of my recent breakups. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, whoa! <laughs> We're getting real. Okay, We're getting real. Okay. <laughs> All right, let me let, let me put my Dr. Phil stuff. On. Oh my God, yeah. I'm thankful for it because okay. like it's taught me stuff. <laughs> the the hose. <laughs> Speaking of, my most hated thing is him. Oh! <laughs> just kidding. Just wow. Kidding. No, no, I'm but sorry. No, Go ahead. Most recent breakup. Yeah, I'm thankful for that because it, um, I guess that breakup taught me how to become a better person, how to mm -hmm. grow. And I was also, like, a very sad person. Well, oh, really? Still am. Yeah. But um, it, it taught me to, like, always fight for myself, do mm -hmm. what I want. Uh, fight for the things that I want to do and so I'm continuing to do that like right now I'm going to school which right. that's what helped me like I was like I need to start doing shit for myself so I mean but it's not like you you just started going to school I mean you already graduated before yeah I did but <laughs> no but I mean like I, I really was I'm not happy like I wasn't like yeah. oh I'm not happy where I'm at and no, it's I'm just like guessing I didn't want to no, be no, no, like no. I'm guessing you up that's what I'm saying <laughs> like she, she ain't stupid <laughs> she already has a degree <laughs> alright I'm just saying but yeah, uh, mostly because it's like, it just taught me like, oh, um, I'm stronger than I think I am. That's all. Absolutely. And work hard. Just, nice. Work thank hard. Thank you. Man, that was real. That was it, a real that's one. the realest shit. Fuck, that, I gotta like, bring some real fuck, shit too. <laughs> 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 Compared to them, that was gonna be very Damn, it started all somber, but <laughs> compared <laughs> to uh, Avengers. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. It doesn't match up to that. But anyways, uh, what I'm thankful for I guess like the second from my list, um, it's my house, my home. I've actually had this house for one year. It's been an my anniversary just passed up Cinco de Mayo this year, and that's I, I feel like it's a huge accomplishment for myself. Uh, I've lived in apartments for a while. Of course, before that, I lived with my mommy. Shouts out to the mommies. Yay! Uh, <laughs> and uh, it's taught me a lot. It's taught me a lot more about responsibilities, especially in a home like maintenance and. Cleaning. <laughs> cleaning like i hate doing those things especially when you're in apartments it's kind of like it's really laid back all you really have to do is make sure the floor is clean and that's it that's it <laughs> if something breaks you just call somebody, somebody to fix it yeah, <laughs> something yeah. Breaks so it's in here house, you're like, fuck uh, who do i call how do, I fix how do you do, how to do youtube google uh ding i diy it diy and, and fuck it up even more god damn it i've done it already too <laughs> Yeah, like my TV downstairs, I installed it. I mean, I know you don't get anybody else to do it, but it's all crooked. 
Uh, like, and we're under construction right I, now. Yeah, we're under construction. <laughs> uh, my fan downstairs in the living room it took me four fucking hours to install. <laughs> <laughs> still have one more fan. I to know. Uh, that's why. That's why I'm taking so long because I'm dreading the time it's gonna take me to do it. But uh, no, I'm so thankful for it. Blessings on top of blessings. And I don't know. Uh, can't wait to see how long I'm gonna stay here. Because <laughs> I'm already talking about like moving out, whatever. But <laughs> like fuck this shit. But anyways, yeah, I'm thankful for my home. Man, man. <laughs> work hard, yeah. Work hard. Um, uh, shit. Um, I'm, <laughs> he's like, my shit. Uh, I'm thankful for <laughs> shit. For shit. <laughs> <laughs> I write that down. S H. S H. Yeah, I love taking E-C. shits. Um, no, I'm thankful for. Um, <laughs> I just got married this year, so hey! I'm, thankful. I'm thankful for my wife. I didn't think he was gonna bring that no, on. I might even stay single for the for the audience out there. <laughs> uh, very thankful for that. Um, and un, uh, you know, I'm blessed because I got a wife who's very understanding of my my hobbies and the and the love affairs I have with with. <laughs> With certain things. Yeah, you better guess her up. Certain things. <laughs> you better guess her uh, up. And one of those things here. being, being uh, anime. Um, you know, not a lot of people can just, you know, sit there with you and watch an anime with you. And one of those animes this year has been My Hero Academia. Oh, um, and it's wow. one of those few shows. We don't really watch a lot of things together. But My Hero Academia has been one of those shows that um, me and her can just both sit down we're excited to watch the next episode mm-hmm. and it's and it's, it's a cool bonding thing for us you know yeah, um, of course starting out as a young you know relationship a young couple to have those things in common is just badass mm-hmm. um so yeah she's been she's great she's amazing and, uh, <laughs> my hero academia is something we share together so i'm oh, thankful for those yeah. things for sure oh cool all right, next. <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, next. What's the what's the uh it's the last one? Damn, we're already on the last we're one. We're already on the last one. Well we still one. gotta do the hateful one. Yeah, 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 yeah. But let, let, let's keep it going. Give it a go. Let's give it a go. I don't know, we're probably rushing through this because like we just did the the podcast, the main podcast. And we've been sitting here forever. Fuck, that, that shit was beefy. <laughs> it was longer than it's probably like one of the longest ones that we've done. But yeah, anyways. I think so. Yeah. I was yeah, telling, sure. talking to him about that. <laughs> I think that was the longest one. Yeah, so this is just me a, bullshitting right now. This is quite this, this episode. It's okay, it's fine. <laughs> I mean, All we right. can add, always add one more. <laughs> hey, that's true. But I don't have another one. But no, no, no. Come on, come on. Go All right, number okay, one. Okay. The number one well, these two most thankful hand thing hand. you have. Hand in hand. That you're well, thankful it's not for. Like, I don't have ranks, but this, these two okay. go hand in okay. hand. I'm thankful for Twitch and my PlayStation. Boom. Yes. No, if you think about it, if I did not stream or whatever whatsoever, uh, Los would have never hit me up to do this podcast thing. Uh, That's true. I would not be yeah. here if I if I didn't stream. Very yeah. true. Very, and so, very, very true. But I'm very thankful because I've met so many great people on Twitch from streaming from my PlayStation. And I actually got my first 300 followers uh, on my PlayStation before I got, like, a capture card. A and capture even card, then, yeah, yeah, even then I still use my playstation because i didn't have a pc up until like way later oh really mm-hmm. oh wow yeah I think so it's... everything like that i've done is is solely from like my playstation so i'm thankful for all of that started from the bottom yeah. started from the bottom oh, and it's like for people who are still trying to stream or who want to stream and want to like get all the like fancy gear and stuff you don't have to do that because yeah straight inspirational no i'm serious you, <laughs> no, I'm you, seriously, you don't have to do any of that you can just do it from your console straight from the playstation 4 or straight from the xbox, xbox. and yeah. i've seen streamers that still do it right now and so um yeah i'm thankful for all the people that i've met um i've grown my network because of that mm-hmm. i've met some people that you know i've grown with them i've mm. it's just a, it's just crazy how much um how many friends that I've made and I've never met these people. Twitch.tv forward slash the girl. girl. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Thank you. Um, I guess my number one, just to move number on. Number one. Number one. Number one. Uh, so making fun of my name. I'm sorry. My number one most thankful thing that I am for this year is the Three Way Podcast. Oh! Hey! Oh! Y'all weren't expecting that. <laughs> Y'all weren't expecting that. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, I'm super thankful for this, this whole you platform. It. it was you all because it. of you, so. 
I mean, not to, you know, whatever. <laughs> no, but um, yeah, I'm super thankful for this actually like going as well as it is right now. It's still super early, still like a baby. Mm -hmm. um, but I, we're all having fun. Like, it's it's great to have like uh, people around you. Uh, our MP to JP. <laughs> Where, JP wherever is, you no, are. He's, he's nah. just somewhere in <laughs> um, a different part of town. No, it's been so great. <laughs> uh, like growing on in this, um, learning from this. Uh, improving on skills that I've always wanted to learn but never had the time or, or like had the commitment to do it but now like that we're doing this podcast stuff um, I mean I'm like committed to uh, editing you know um, on the computer I'm committed to uh, meeting up uh, doing the podcast pre pre meets when we do phone calls uh, gathering information throughout the week to do the shows and coming up with these different ideas different stupid <laughs> ideas but it's not just me like we all work together like coming up with stuff and it's been great it's been something so so like like a relief like i'm taking a breath for the first time because i feel like like my creative side is is being able to ex be expressed like a lot more mm -hmm. and this is this has been just so much fun it's been such a positive thing uh a lot of like a lot of things actually changed in this in this year for me like the three way podcast is one one of the most major ones. I mean, this year too, I've I've lost weight. I lost like sixty pounds. Work and, hard. <laughs> I mean, there's so many things this year that I've been I'm so thankful for. But right now, for me, like the biggest one is the three way podcast and everything, the the community that's been growing, the comments we've been getting, uh, the feedback. Like it it it's showing that like we're we're not the only ones who who want to hear us talk about something, you know? Um, but it's great. Everybody that's been involved, JP, Carlos, M, who came in later, uh, even our RIP fired intern. I mean, <laughs> I mean it's we'll been great. Be I mean, we're, we're always evolving, always changing. And it's just uh, it's just something that's like uh, that I also enjoy doing too. Like I don't want it just to be stale too. Like mm -hmm. be doing the same thing every every day. Like let's change it up, let's mix it up. I love doing that. That that's like I say, it's it's freeing my my creative side. And I'm just so thankful for this and everybody that's involved. Thank you. Bet, bet, bet. Yeah, work hard. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I just got something in my eye. Like, for yeah, real. yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> I really do. Um. Um. Okay. <laughs> Another thing I'm thankful for this year is uh, Nintendo. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, Nintendo has been such a huge part of my life. Yes. Um, through my childhood, through my hard years in high school, mm -hmm. through college, through me now being a full-sized adult. Semi-sized yes, adult. Yes, yes. Um, it's been there now through my marriage. Uh, the Amiibo were actually... <laughs> the the <laughs> Mario and Peach Amiibos were actually on my wedding cake. Yeah, they were. Um, so cute. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's been a part of my marriage. It's, you know, my wife, uh, you know, plays with me at times. It's just another common thing. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> she goes grabs no, the toys. Yeah, like, <laughs> they start playing with each other. With <laughs> plays Nintendo with me, but uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, um, you know, oh they they've been such a life changer for me. Uh, just overall, this year with the Switch, it's been, you know, it's auto automatically one of my favorite consoles. Uh, take it anywhere, uh, play anything I want. Um, it's just, it's just, I'm, uh, you know. At this stage of my life, uh, where we're moving, I'm getting, you know, I'm married. Uh, it's uh, Nintendo's as good friend that's been there along the whole way. So, um, <laughs> well, I'm excited to see what Nintendo and Look, you I, have in I, store. I, I love my wife. <laughs> I love Nintendo. Uh, I love, I love Travis Scott. <laughs> Travis Scott's okay, but Nintendo, bro. You've been there for me the day entire one. time. My yeah, day yeah. one. Uh, Ride or day die. one. Be, be, Ride or die. <laughs> When I was in that thing, you know? Uh, but yeah, so I was. Alright, <laughs> fuck this mushy shit. We show what we're thankful for. Yeah. It's time to get real. It's, it's time to stop being polite. And it's time to start getting real. What the fuck are we fucking hateful for? What do you hate? What do you dislike? Oh, I'm ready. What the hell did you fucking want to kill yourself over this year? Go.
Go. <laughs> Go now. Not even this year. This is all the fucking time. Oh, I, shit. I'm, I'm hateful for cilantro. Cilantro. <laughs> cilantro. Yeah, cilantro. What's cilantro. cilantro. You can barely, barely even kind of taste it so when you put it on something. I can taste it. It's gross. Oh my God. Cilantro. Okay, oh let's go. Let's go deeper Can inside of this. Like, where does this stem from? Yeah, right what is it. what does this stem from? It just tastes gross. It's nasty as fuck. Really? Yeah, that's why I'm saying that. <sighs> I don't know. It's, it, it's good. It, it's I don't like onions on a taco, but you know I like cilantro. Cilantro's legit. <laughs> fuck cilantro. Y'all keep saying that I'm Hispanic. I'm not Hispanic. I hate cilantro. Yeah, RFP to cilantro. Damn. There's like, I think there's like, of like forums and stuff on people that hate cilantro. Did you what? know? One of those yeah. people in Reddit. Like, sure there is. I read yeah. like this thing where it's like people with like their taste buds. Taste buds. Taste buds. Taste buds. Oh, welcome they're, back, JP. They're, <laughs> they're, um, it's like there's something in their taste buds that makes yeah. cilantro taste like soap, which is why it's so hard to eat. Yeah, it's it's like a weird biological like anatomy thing. I don't know, but yeah, that's essentially what it tastes like. It tastes it's really gross. Like I can't eat it without like wanting to like uh, uh, gag. It's gross. Oh wow. Yeah, it's nasty. Oh wow. Okay. Like, I I'm mean, very, love like, about you. Yes. Like I, you know? I love cilantro. cilantro. You put it on tacos. Yes. You put it on the hot sauce. <gasps> How do you not? Uh, Fuck cilantro. I don't know. You were just designed different. Fuck cilantro. What do you hate? I fucking hate from the depths of the bottom of my just tainted heart. What do I hate? I don't know. I'm, man, honestly, I've been like such like getting away from all that negativity shit. I don't remember what I hate the most. Oh, right wow. now. Damn, you don't hate anything. Like no, it's like Look at you with your zen ass though. It's like it's like <laughs> it's like you kind of like block that shit out or not, not even like let it like be a part of your life, you know? But if I really have to think about it and like something I really just don't fucking like, it's it's probably going to be like such a thing and that's a bad thing or like something that no I mean it's it's going to be something that's not popular basically. I don't like how <laughs> I don't like, I fucking hate how we're all okay with the way Ryan Reynolds plays Deadpool. Oh my god. <laughs> I fucking oh, hate it. Opinion. He's so good as Deadpool. Bro, I fucking but hate that shit. But that's how Deadpool's personality is. He's so know. good as Deadpool. I fucking hate it. It's so fucking annoying. It's like even in the like, comics. Yes. I try to like, like Deadpool's it. Deadpool's personality is and like that. No, no one will like, agree with you. I Everybody loves Deadpool. Unpopular opinion. Deadpool, like the way he plays him, it's just so fucking annoying. It feels like he's trying too hard. Like, like nice back. Heart. Deadpool tries hard. <laughs> You're a try it's hard fucking too. Deadpool. You're a try hard too. <laughs> oh, damn. Always putting in a hard difficulty. Get the fuck out of here, you fucking try hard. <laughs> Fucking try her. Get the hell out of here. By the way, don't forget to follow Jerks and watch him on Twitch. When he's Die a hundred times. Call of Duty. Yeah, I've been, I've been Twitch streaming. Twitch.tv forward slash JRX. 4X. Yeah, I've been streaming lately. But I fucking, I don't know. I don't like it. I hate. That's why I'm not too, like, sold on the Pikachu detective thing. Because oh it's right now. Oh, my God. Hater. If you like, guys haven't watched our Monday podcast or listened to our Monday podcast, go listen to it now. Like, we'll see what we talk like, about. Like, it, it's growing on me. But, man, like, it, like if I had to go with, like, Bare Bones, Essentials, fuck that guy. Like, I used to love him when he did the, the movies. Uh, was it the Van Wilder? Like those, those movies for me at the time were funny as hell, but then you try rewatching them, they're fucking stupid. And fucking then, uh, waiting, waiting. Why is the waiting time pretty good? Yeah. And uh, so what's it? What's the other one? The best friends one? Uh, 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 uh. Fuck! I forgot what it's called. Uh, friend zone. I don't know. But anyways, yeah, I think that sounds about right. It's something like that. But anyways, he, he was funny. I like those movies. But I don't know. Maybe maybe it's just me. My humor. It's kind of like like changing, and the Ryan Reynolds humor is kind of like weighing on me i'm kind of like okay i'm kind of over it bro but i don't know i just i don't fucking like Deadpool. all right well <laughs> oh you know what i fucking hated too in the first one it was the fucking music they use why the fuck what? use dmx that shit is so stupid i liked it i actually like the music DMX that they used so right. oh okay yeah, yeah. that's my <laughs> most hateful <laughs> wow um okay um the thing i hated most this year 
just grinds my gears. Grinds your gears. Grinds my fucking Tell gears us. deep. Grind. Fucking Kanye West. Oh my god. Fuck you, yes, Kanye I'm West. Let me, let me. Okay. First of all, you're not the same rapper you were before. Agreed. Mm, true. Not even close. Facts. Agreed. He did come Big out facts. with that one with Lil Pump. That shit you're was You're such pretty, a fucking hoe. I love it. Okay. Pretty catchy, You're pretty such good. Such a fucking hoe. I love Next. it. Next, this motherfucker Your starts going on ramblings. Door, make oven. These rambles, where not only do we not know what the fuck he, he's talking about, most of the time he doesn't know what the fuck he's talking <laughs> about. That's because that's because we're all here. Oh my god. Kanye though. No, the guy is a fucking idiot. Boom. Boom. The oh. guys are fucking. Don't get me wrong. He's levels above us. I bro. used to look up to Kanye West. Levels, dimensions. I used to think, man, this guy, he really is looking out for the people. He's rapping about it. You know, he he's ahead. He's ahead of our time. Well, this year the motherfucker just took fucking ten years step back. He's a oh, fucking didn't he piece say, of shit. Didn't he say something about like slavery was like the fault of the black people or some yeah, shit like that? Yeah, he said. He, he said some. Like, he said some dumbass dumb shit. Dumb ass shit. He like, said, said some like, of the most dumbest shit. I don't know. Year. Like if Kanye from music was okay, but then it started kind of weighing. Like it started like going south for yeah. him. And then, and then all of a sudden he starts like going past the music, going to like, like what's going on in the current politics, what's going on in other social oh aspects Lord. of life. So okay, like so it's just why. Ever since he married into that family, it's been just you think fucking that, I've trash. heard I heard that that it, like, theory a, too. Hey man, everybody who's married into that family, they're fucking bringing down his IQ. It's the money, really, man. It's really the money is. too. The money yeah. just money makes you stupid. It makes you fucking <laughs> think you're. A, you're something above. You're a god. You're really not. No one gives a shit what you say. Not anymore, especially Kanye. Um, second, <laughs> second, this motherfucker um, is be, be all up on Trump's dick. That's one thing, right? I, I really could care less if you support Trump or not as a fucking famous person. That's your fucking right. But the but, fact that you're like putting it on your platform... For other people to see when no, you're it's just not music? even that it's not even that that did annoy me but then to come back and be like i'm being used he's using me for his own problem oh, okay. like bro what the fuck is wrong with you who how, if you're supposedly the second coming on another fucking level and you're being fucking manipulated by by trump of all else who can't fucking shut a fucking umbrella. Oh, okay. all right, all right. Are you fucking <laughs> kidding me? We're, 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 I don't give a we're, shit. We're a trapezing thin wire kind of thing. We don't want to go into nah, the No, no, no. Trump, I don't care. He could, couldn't shut a fucking umbrella. It's a fact. This is all I'm okay, saying. It's okay. facts. You couldn't close an umbrella. So this guy's manipulating you and you're above it all. You're transcended humanity. Oh, shit. The fuck out of here. You're fucking <laughs> trash. You're, I hate you. You're not worth shit. Wow. Get the fuck out of here with that shit. R.I.P. Kanye West, you were the real one. Get the one. fuck out of here, Kanye. And you want to come on the show to ramble on for fucking 30 minutes while no one fucking talks over you? Fuck you. All right. All well, right. that's been the Hump Day Show. Thanks for watching the Hump Day Show. <laughs> no, but uh, fuck. That was like, wow. That was really inspirational. Thank you. Damn. That was. Zam. Thanks. Trash bin <laughs> Kanye. I think we have to have like a whole compilation of just like trash bins for Lowe's. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, going. We'll yeah. have a special trash bin for him. Nikki. And then he just throws pictures in Nikki, there every time. Nikki, like Kanye, and something. Tim Allen. Oh, my God. <laughs> the, the trash collector. All right. Yeah, All fuck right. Kanye West. He's a <laughs> shit. Uh, I'll see him in the hell. Sounds good. All right. Thanks well. Thank you guys. It's been the Hum Day Show. Sorry, I'm just mad. I'm just angry. We're at ending it on a positive note positive here. Positive note. Positive note. Don't eat the hell, guys. Up. Don't no. eat cilantro. Oh my Don't god. Tell us what you hate. West. But thank you so much for listening. Um, <laughs> again, social media is the Three Way Podcast on Instagram, Number Facebook, three. Twitter, uh, Twitch. If you watch us on Twitch, we're gonna be streaming. Um, if you're watching, this, actually, if you're watching this right now, we're probably gonna be streaming the same day. Oh no, streaming the next day. Thursday. Yeah, Thursday. For, we'll for Thanksgiving. Tomorrow. This comes out on Wednesday. Yes, because it's a Monday show. All yes, right. We'll be streaming tomorrow. We'll be streaming tomorrow, guys. If you have Thursday. To do. Uh, November, whatever the day for Thanksgiving is. 23rd, 22nd. 
22nd. <laughs> yeah, we'll be streaming, so follow us on twitch.tv slash the three-way podcast. No. We're going to be doing our passion party group stream. Our monthly uh, stream. We're going to be doing Overcooked 2 and Super Smash Brothers uh, Wii U. Uh, so come check it out. Uh, a player smash. Yes. Uh, yeah, we're just going to try and beat the shit out of each other. Can't wait. Just everyday life. Mm-hmm. Uh, but yeah, thanks again for listening, watching. And again, uh, the main podcast is on Spotify. Uh, you Social media, everything in the description below. And thank you so much. Tell us what you hate. Tell us what you hate.